So if you're promoting a affiliate offers like Clickbank offers with Google ad, this is the video you have to watch. Watching this video will help you to get more and more conversion with your Google ad campaign, Google ad search campaigns. Because with the Google ads, one of the key thing is their keywords. Their keywords will show your ads to the right audience. And if you don't know how to pick the right keyword for your ads, and if you don't place your ad with the right keyword, then you will not going to get any conversion with your Google ads. And this video will help you to understand keyword match type of Google ads which will help you to run your campaign with Google ads promoting an affiliate offer. So if you are first time here, my name is Raj. Welcome to my channel Affiliate Conversion where I'm uploading videos related to affiliate marketing and you're watching the part two videos of Google ad for affiliate marketing series. Whereas I already uploaded the part one video where I showed you how you can rank your ad in the search engine result page by improvising the quality score. So must watch this first video and smash the like button of this video because it will give you more sales conversion. Subscribe my channel, put the bell notification. With that said, let's start. So in my last video, I showed you how you can rank your ad in the search engine result page so that people should click in your ad and buy your product. But now the most important thing is you should rank or show your ad to the right audience. For that, you have to understand the keyword match type for Google ads. Okay, because keyword is the thing which people use to search their queries in the Google ads. And if you know right type of the keyword and how to use their keyword right in the Google ads, you can easily show your ad in front of the audience who are buyer intent and who can buy your products. Google ads, there are like four to five keyword types. Okay, that is broad match, modified match, and phrase match, exact match, and then we have a negative match. So now let's understand one by one how these keyword match types work. So the number one is broad match keywords. Okay, and here we are going to use these two keywords diabetes and cure okay assuming that we want to place or show our ad for this diabetes and cure okay these are the two keywords and we are using the broad match so while using the broad match we will not use any symbols here ads might show for search queries that include targeted keywords and close variant so when you use diabetes and cure it will show our ads to the targeted keyword that is diabetes and cure plus close variant now you have to understand this term right which is very very important close variant so close variant stand for singular and plural form of these two keywords as well as misspelling of these two keywords and synonyms okay the alternative words which people use right for diabetes for example guys if somebody is going to type like diabetes and cures it will trigger our ad okay and for example, I'm using another word to show you the difference. Okay. Marketing. If we want to show our ad to marketing, right. And if somebody is searching for marketings, our ad will show to them. Okay. And misspellings. Okay. Like diabetes. Okay. Marketing. Okay. If somebody is going to use a wrong words, then also our ad is going to show to them. And then we have synonyms guys like militus right blood sugar this, this is what these are the terms right people use for alternative like diabetes or cure okay or for marketing is like sell trade promotion so whenever people are going to, going to use all this keyword our ad will going to show to them okay which we don't want we want to show our ad to only diabetes cure okay if we use as a broad match our ad will show to all of those things so as from the name you can understand guys it's a broad match it will trigger to all the keywords like diabetes cure news research permanently food type 1 medicine cora okay 2021 all those keywords in any order here you can see here the, the, the diabetes cure come first and you have many many other keywords here you can see diabetes and uh, in between th there will be some words like type 1, 2, permanently, all these things our ad will show. Okay, like this here in the beginning itself, it have some word like type 1 diabetes, type 2 diabetes, right? All these things, okay? So in any order, people are searching for these two keywords, guys, our ad will show to them, okay? Which we don't want. We want to show our ads to diabetes and cure only. 
So what is the advantage of using the broad match? You're going to get more clicks. Okay, more and more, more clicks because our ad is now visible to a lot of keywords. Okay, a lot of people who is searching, right, uh, different keywords. But the problem is those keywords are not relevant keyword. Okay, those are not the relevant keyword. Those are not the targeted audience. Those are not the buyer intent audience. Okay, and less sales, of course. Okay, because it's showing to all those people who are irrelevant. Okay, and this is the advantage, more clicks, but there are many disadvantage, okay, using the broad match. Then we have guys, modified broad match. So from the name, you can understand this is like modified the broad match. Again, it is a broad match, but it is modified in a layman language, guys. I can say this, using this keyword, you are giving instruction by adding plus symbol right before each of this keyword okay two keyword three keyword four keyword whatever it is okay like in the diabetes before the diabetes we add plus and after that uh, in the cure also we add plus okay we can also use without adding any symbol in the diabetes then we can add plus in the cure i'm going to show you what is the meaning of that okay let's understand what is modified broad match okay so again it will show our ads to all of those keywords okay like how broad match work the same way modified broad match also work okay it will show the uh, our ads trigger our ads uh, to all of those keywords in any order okay but here is one thing this time there is no synonyms okay because in the last in the broad match it will trigger to the synonyms also again the close variants are there like singular plural misspellings right all those things is there right the blending of words are there but no synonyms no alternative words because this time we have given little instruction okay we are narrowing down right now so now let's understand if we add plus sign before diabetes and plus sign cure right what kinds of right search queries our ad will trigger okay here you can see if somebody is typing diabetes cure in their search query this two keyword should be there in any order in any order this two keyword should be uh, there okay if we are adding plus sign in diabetes and plus sign uh, right in the cure both of these two keywords should be there in the search query let's say if we are not adding plus sign in diabetes but we are adding in the plus sign right in cure okay then the search query will be something like this okay hangover cure the cure okay hiv cure a cure for wellness all those word the uh, the search queries which have cures right our ad will show to them okay including the diabetes uh, cure okay all those cures let's say this time right we are adding plus sign in diabetes but not adding the plus sign in cure then our ad will trigger to all the diabetes uh, symptoms militus meaning diet definition prevention and but not the cure the cure will be not very important now apart from this guys everything remain the same okay and what is the advantage for this more clicks again less relevance in the broad match there is like no relevant at all okay but here you are going to see some relevancy because you are giving instruction show my ad to diabetes and cure okay these two keywords should be there in the search phrases okay and less relevance and less sales also okay so now phrase match so with this word you can understand say phrase match diabetes and cure so in while using the phrase match we are using this quotation there these two terms okay diabetes and cure by using this term we are telling show the ad when this phrase appears in the search query same order now understand this guys in the broad match in modified broad match in any order okay any keyword be will be there on those terms okay but on this here in the phrase match we are telling same order including the close variant okay so here you can see type one diabetes cure type two diabetes cure these two keywords should be together okay and that is how it is it is going to show okay and in what type of keyword it will not show okay like if somebody is typing diabetic symptom 
diabetes mellitus you know why because this both terms is not together in this search query so as well as guys any of this search query so it will not show to all of this search query so any search query which have diabetes and cure on the same format okay in the same order it will trigger our ad so now using the phrase match you're going to get more targeted clicks because right now you have narrowing down the audience and you are re reaching to the right audience you are giving more restrictions on your ad or you're giving instruction to your google ad then show my ads to these people only okay so more targeted clicks more relevancy okay this will increase your quality score so now you can understand guys you should not use the broad match at all right here you're going to lose a lot of money you can use the broad modified broad match and phrase match as well as the exact match with the name you can understand we are going to put the bracket in the uh, both of the terms okay which we are looking in the search queries of the target audience if somebody is going to type these two terms there right our ad will trigger which will bring more targeted clicks more high rele uh, relevancy that means our quality score will be high and you're going to get more sales so now you can understand guys advantage and disadvantage so this is my experience i am uh, sharing here advantage and disadvantage it can vary person to person the best form is guys when you combine modified broad match phrase match exact match together okay when you combine this thing that i'm going to show you in a second you will get more accurate results okay or you will take your ad to right audience who are buyer intent that i'm going to show you in a second now before that we have one more keyword type that is negative keywords the as from the name itself you can now know that negative keywords means excluding those keywords in which we don't want to show our ads because guys you can use exact keyword but remember this when you use diabetes cure you're also losing a lot of other phrases which people are searching maybe the buy intent keyword like how to cure type 1 diabetes okay so if you only going to use exact keyword you're going to lose those people who is typing like how to cure type 1 diabetes okay that is the reason you're going to use phrase match you're going to use modified broad match and all those things along with this thing guys sometime you're also going to remove those keyword which you don't want to uh, trigger your ads okay and that we're going to create in uh, negative keywords for this negative keywords guide i'm going to create a another video on a deep video uh, and i'm going to show you here because guys for negative keywords you should know how to use google keyword planner that means you should know what are those keywords which is not right for your niche or maybe for your product and that you can easily find out when you do the keyword research okay for that i'm going to create a different video but what is the benefit of using negative keyword of course it can trigger clicks okay high relevancy more uh, right sales you use this negative keyword along with guys modified broad match phrase match and exact match but what is the benefit of negative keywords so here you can see if you add a negative keyword the benefit is it will create more relevant ad groups okay so guys while creating negative keyword guys you can create negative keyword by match type keyword match type or campaign type also okay that is the reason i want to create that thing in a uh, another different video right you will weed out the keyword that are not re related you will remove those keyword which is not relevant to you improve click through rate now you can know what is mean by click through rate more the click through rate right your quality score will be higher the ad will rank in desired keywords okay save money definitely because it you will avoid paying for useless clicks there and raise your conversion rate so your ad is going straight to the buyer intent audience of that particular niche or maybe a particular product but meanwhile we will understand broad match modified broad match phrase match, and exact match so this was the product i took as a demo to show you this series okay sarah care and they also have this affiliate page here you can get a lot of tools right the keywords banners and all those things so you, you can see they have a huge keyword list so till this point guys you are very much clear that you should not use all of those keywords okay and you, you can see whenever you create a ad group create with one particular keyword that that's what i showed you in the last video so make sure you watch the part one video okay so here we are going to use the keyword diabetes only so look at this they have a lot of keywords over here so how are you going to use it this is completely up to you right what kind of keyword you want to use so for example 
let's say you selected some of the keyword okay for meanwhile we'll go with diabetes cure only so here we are in the google ads right ad group and uh, as i said like each ad group you have to target one particular keyword like in this ad group first ad group i am targeting like blood sugar and i am going to use that kind of keyword only and when i'm going to create the ad labels under that like one two three i will target more these kinds of keyword uh, in the ad text plus my landing page and the same thing right now we are using in the ad group to the diabetes cure this is the keyword which we are targeting right now so here you can see guys diabetes cure okay now you know that what is diabetes cure stand for right it's a broad match we are definitely not going to use it so remove this one here okay and then we have diabetes cure okay this is like modified broad match we are giving instruction to google ads that show my ads which uh, the queries have this diabetes and cure as a word you are also not going to use like diabetes plus cure okay depend do not ask me which keyword match type is going to bring you more sale there is nothing you have to combine according to your niche every time depend upon the keywords you have to use this thing right only one instruction i can give that is you should not use broad match you should know which are the buyer intent keyword so i don't want to use di diabetes because i want to show my ads for diabetes and cure so i'm not going to use this one i'm also not going to use this one okay so now i have like modified broad match and then i have a phrase match i am telling google right show uh, my ads right if the search query have like diabetes and cure on that okay in any order now the thing is both are almost if you see the similar only but there is one difference when you use the diabetes and cure you are telling like any order okay any order that keyword should be there in the phrase in any order maybe together maybe have some other words on that so here you can see in the modified broad match you are saying in any order but in the phrase match you are saying in the same order that's what you want so using both of these like it's in a right way and then you are also telling like exact match right somebody searching for diabetes cure show my ad for this okay so these are the three i'm going to use in this so every time guys according to your keywords you have to use this uh, uh, keyword match type okay that is no particular right profitable keyword match types okay like in diabetes niche maybe people are searching more this kinds of keyword how to cure type 1 diabetes so now you can put this phrase into the phrase match with the quotation marks or maybe you can use the exact match okay this all up to you uh, you can also use the phrase match modifier so now this is the fifth kind of like a modifier here and that is phrase match modifier where what you're doing is like you're adding plus sign before diabetes and a dot that is a full stop or a period and then you are writing cure and you are marking that thing as a quotation mark right so what will happen is ad will show when search query matches the targeted keyword as a phrase so for example guys here i put the quotation mark then i have this plus sign and then i have a diabetes period or the full stop cure and then i have plus again center period of period united period nation and then the quotation marks so now google will consider this both term together okay diabetes and cure uh, center of united nation together so anybody is going to search for this query and if their query have these two phrases there together like diabetes cure and center of united nation together in any any order it will trigger our ad so like this year diabetes cure center of united states and it's highly targeted clicks you're going to get right highly relevant and more sales for you so now everything is in your hand guys how you want to use the keyword and what type of keyword you want to use right how you want to place those keyword using the keyword match type you want to use the modified uh, broad match phrase match exact match that all up to you when you create the ad label or the ad text it should have the same keyword you are optimizing this same keyword in your ad text as well as in the landing page
I'm also going to show you right how to create the landing page for Google Ads in my upcoming videos. Hope you understand keyword match type of Google Ads because this will help you right to reach out to target audience or relevant audience who can buy your products. Okay, so make sure you're watching the first part of the video where I shared about the quality score, how to increase your quality score and then keyword match type this video part two video. Hope you got values. If you got the value, smash the like button right away right now. Share this video to your loved one and do not forget to share your comments guys. In the comment, I read all the comments, right? How do you see this video? How you got the value? What are the more things you want to know? You have any doubt in this? Let me know in the comment and subscribe my channel, smash the like button and I'll meet you in the part three video of this series. And if you have not seen the part one video, you must watch this video which is popping up right now in the window which will guide you how to rank your Google ad in the search engine result page so that you can get more and more clicks right with lower cost as compared to other advertiser.